Hello and welcome back. This chapter will guide you through the steps in manifesting your dreams. You also learn the importance of controlling your thought process and believing in yourself. Our thought process plays a big role in our successes. Researchers have said that the concept we are what we say we are is a statement that greatly influences our identity. Our state of mind drives our actions. We achieve in life when we can visualize our success. It is at this moment our resolve, determination, and confidence kicks in. The first step in manifesting your dreams is by being realistic and focusing on what you do. Don't let yourself spend time focusing on what you can't do, but rather on what you're doing and what you can continue to work on towards your goals and dreams. No one ever achieved anything without dreaming and putting that dream into action and succeeding. Depending on how you use it, your thoughts can be your worst critic, but it's also your best ally. Your thoughts are partially responsible for your actions and behaviors. Therefore, you need to guard your thoughts. Bring to awareness both negative and positive thoughts and decide which to listen to. How do you decide? Simple. Keep the ones that empower you and discard those that disempower you. For those that keep coming up and disempowering you, you have to ask yourself why. If it keeps coming up as a pattern, there's a reason behind it. Observe those thoughts and find the root cause of it. The second step to put into action is to surround yourself with people who support your goals and dreams. Surround yourself with people who support your endeavors and ask them to help you counter your negativity. Nip it in the bud before it has time to cause you to lose your focus. The third step is to get rid of all excuses. All of us have something we really want to obtain but keep finding excuses not to. Maybe you want to start on a walking routine each day, but there are always house chores to do that must come first. Maybe you plan to take up golf, but there's always one more report to write for work. We are so good at making excuses about why some things are more important than other things, but the truth is life balance means prioritizing time for the things we want to do is as important as doing the things we know we must do. We all know how important a diary is and the importance of scheduling our time and planning to achieve the thing we need to accomplish. In theory, we would love to execute each and every activity planned for the day as written in our diary, yet still we make excuses at the end of the day when we fail to check off everything from the list. One method to keep track of your unaccomplished tasks is by writing them down and stating the reasons why you did not manage to complete them. Be honest with yourself about the excuses you made to justify why you didn't do them. Maybe you felt too tired or maybe you were fearful of walking that track alone. Maybe you decided to cook a nice dinner for your family instead of going to the movies. Maybe it's not as important as you thought it was. Everybody wants to be healthy and they know that they need to eat healthily. It's scheduled in but we don't take action on it simply because it's not top on our value list. Remember, excuses don't have to be negative. Excuses are really choices we make. Sometimes we make choices that are valid. Other times our choices are a reflection of other things going on in our lives. Therefore, writing down our excuses is really about writing down our choices. Why did we choose not to do something? Did we simply choose to do something else? Perhaps we were able to modify a choice to make it more achievable. Once we understand the choices we make, we are in a better position to change our actions, attitudes, or behaviors if necessary to make better choices. Our choices are the essential keys to how well we prioritize looking after our mental, physical, and inner health. The next step is to ensure you are on the right track in achieving your dreams is by managing your time. Never underestimate the importance of five minutes. No matter how hectic our days are, we all have five minutes to spare in our day and it can do so much to change our perspective on how we go through our daily lives. What can be accomplished in five minutes and how does it help our journey to self-discovery? Practice these three activities within five minutes if possible each and every day. One, take five minutes each day to clear out some clutter in your life. 
maybe a work area, a pantry, or a garage. Allow yourself to enjoy the moment when you have completed it. Organizing helps us think clearer and set our focus. Research shows that people with a tidy work area achieve more productivity than those with a cluttered area. 2. Take 5 minutes to go for a walk and find something beautiful in your world you haven't seen before. It will open up a way to count the other blessings in your life that often stay hidden from view as we are often too busy to enjoy them. 3. Take 5 minutes to pray, meditate, or have sessions in your day where you reflect on yourself and your spiritual health and well-being. Never underestimate the power of 5 minutes in your life. Finally, focus on your strengths. Do you remember the story of the tortoise and the hare? We were often told that slow and steady wins the race, and there is truth in that. What is interesting about this story is that both the tortoise and the hare were using their natural talents. They use them to the best of their ability. From the point of view of personal development, take a closer look and see what happened in this story. When we compare ourselves to the tortoise and the hare, we can learn some important life lessons to help us in our endeavors. The tortoise did what he did best, to the best of his ability. He did not let circumstances overwhelm him, but instead he did what was asked of him and he eventually found success. This simply means each and every one of us possesses different and unique talents. All that's left to do is to identify what they are and use them to their fullest potential. When we use them to our advantage, we can surely beat any circumstances and manifest our dreams.